Hello anybody, I am Alpaca Patrol, and this is EU4, that's right, I'm back, another episode of EU4. So, something occurred to me, uh, while, while I was not recording videos, is, um, you know, we don't have any troops in the Idrisid's territory, so we might want to land some there first. So, let's, let's go ferry some troops over before we start this war. I hate having to, to, you know take time not doing what I what I want to do. I probably shouldn't have done this, because I, I lose some, some dudes. But we have the manpower to bring it back, so it's fine. It's okay. Um, so we're going to ferry troops over to this land. Excellent. Attach transport. You guys come up over here. Actually, you guys come over here. We get some troops in, uh, in some lands. It's going to be great. We go to Safi, get some more. It's gonna take a while, we only have two cogs, so we're only transporting 2,000 men every time. Which is really unfortunate. Oh, Zakoy has tragically died. Oh fuck, our heir died again? Why does this keep happening? Alright, well that's a problem. Luckily we don't have royal marriages with like fucking anybody. Oh my god, with the stability! Our nobles' estates close to the frontier are concerned that they're our defenses. They voice their lives oh, well, fucking... Okay, so we lost stability again. This game does not want me to have stability at all, it seems. But that's okay. We'll just begin the ferrying process over here. And it'll be just fine. You guys can come here. Get the two every time. This is why we need a bigger navy, friends. This is why we need a bigger navy. I don't think they have any men here, so I think it's still okay. Only, only like three more trips, and then, and then we're good. What's the supply limit here? Probably very high. Yeah, it's 37. Spain has a crazy supply limit. Now here's another thing. This Tangiers uh, area is gonna give us a lot of money later on too, so that's good. At least our legitimacy is low, which is a bummer. But uh, we're about to get some more legitimacy, I'm sure. By goodness. And gracious. Um, and you know what? I think this is fine for now. I think I think we'll be okay. Revolt risks revolt possible in if need. Why? Why is the revolt possible? What's the? Why do we have revolt risk? Bedouin patriots defect to the Idrisids. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna do it. I'm gonna spend all of our military power here. Harsh treatment. I don't want any of this shit happening. I don't want any of this shit happening. What's our supply limit here? We're good. Oh, they're getting on the boats. We could destroy their navy. Right off the bat. We don't have a leader here, so we're gonna have to hire one. That's okay. Wow, he's really good, actually. Let's get our navy in here. Ah, oh, shit, they're moving. Just get up there. I want to go capture them. I want to be able to get where their navy is. Come on out, navy. Oh, perfect. What? Where did they go? Okay, they're here. They are here. Okay, perfect. The perfect time to attack. Glorious. We shall begin our war, then. Declare war. Call willing allies. Yes. Okay, here we go. Take Fez. War is declared. We're gonna destroy their navy here. And begin our conquest of the Idrisid's land. Oh, good. They're, they're continuing to engage me. Which is amazing. You guys, I want to get you to the my war goal. Because I think the Shaibans will uh, will help us. Okay, we, we had another victory here. I'm just going to come over here and, and be okay. Oh, good. We have more, more forces here. Okay. Uh, 
You know what? Let's get all of you guys up here. Let's take these guys out. Desert Mountain. So we would lose... They would get 25% defensiveness. I think we should still be fine. I think we should still be fine. We have a better leader, we have fire, and we have extra shock power. So I think we're be, we'll be okay. Yeah, we're gonna... We're gonna destroy them, actually. So that's great. Okay. And we could, um... Detach a siege. Come over here. Uh, who are these guys? Alright, we're getting out there. Okay. Now, we could detach sieges here, but I'd rather keep my army in strength. Because we have these nine troops here. Oh, perfect. Where are you guys going? You're going to the Gulf of Cadiz? You're going to get killed is what you're doing. Goodbye. Goodbye, boats. Yeah. We lost, uh... They lost four. We lost nothing. And we gained five prestige from that. That is ridiculous, man. Naval battles give you a lot. They give you a whole lot. Alright, let's continue this blockade. Uh, you guys can detach blockade, or detach siege, rather. And then continue this. Okay. They actually are rallying quite a force. Shaiban's not fucking doing anything, though. Even though. That's okay. Oh, god damn it. Sunni patriots have risen up. That's annoying. So do these sieges really take this many dudes? No, it doesn't look like it. You guys come over here. Alright, we're, we're gonna have these guys deal with these Sunni Patriots. And, uh, they'll have a- they'll have an army. Musaids declared war on the Korolids. Excellent, so we don't have to worry about them. So that's good. Okay, there's 12 men there. What do we have? what do we have here? Just desert. Hmm. It's really unfortunate. Whoa, 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 whoa. 14... Oh, boy, oh, boy. There's a lot of boats there. But we could destroy them, actually. I'm gonna go do it. They only have, uh... They, have, they don't have any heavies at all. And they have galleys. Is this an inland sea, though? I don't know... Let me make sure, because I know this is an inland sea. Store belt, this is an inland sea. And this is not, right? That's an inland sea, the Gulf of Almeria. Okay, so they have a lot of galleys, but that's okay, we could go bust them up. Oh, and these guys we could bust up too. Oh yeah, we're going to win these battles. I have five heavy ships, this is going to be enough to destroy these guys. And, uh... We'll get this shit working soon. Okay, we'll go deal with these these patriots here. Okay, they're they're retreating to the inland sea. That's okay. They're sending two troops in. I guess I guess we should go deal with them first. And then blow up these Alexandrian troops. Uh, we should destroy them, by the way. Yeah, especially with, with that. Okay. <laughs> See you later, Uwasayids. See you later, buddies. Have a good night. Enjoy the show. Okay. So now that we won... Yeah, I will, I will recommend that they attach to this unit. Now all we have to do is siege out Fez, and then, um, and then glory will be unto us, and it's gonna be great. Is this interested land? It is. Man, interested are actually fairly powerful, but we are more powerful. Far more powerful. And these guys are mostly good doing what they're doing. Hmm. Sieges are looking good so far. Looking good so far. 
Kuali Suleiman is looking good as well. I really wish the Idrisids would help in any way. That would be really nice. I mean, I guess they're scaring off the, uh, or I'm sorry, the Shybons would help in any way. But, uh, you know, I, I guess they're scaring off the other dudes, so that's good, at least. I really hope that we can get here before this rebellion is done. I mean, we should be able to stomp their asses. You know, one one zero versus, yeah, a 3-3-2. Three, three, yeah, I'm sorry about this, Rebels, but I'm gonna have to beat the shit out of you. Sorry about this. Wow, they're actually doing more damage than I expected them to. We actually lost 600 men, which sucks. Hey! Siege of Mercy is done. Amazing. Amazing. Alright, and where are you guys going? Sunni army, we're... Jen. Alright, get to Jen then. Or Jen A. I don't know what it is. Uh, let's go siege out Grenada. Again, I'm not even looking for these other lands. This is just for war score. Which, you know, we're gonna we're gonna take. We're gonna take the war score. And then we could get more troops in this land, and if we do that, then we will potentially be able to Where did these rebels go? Are the rebels gone? Hold on. Sunni zealots. They wanna convert Why? Why did this suddenly begin? Is it because our fucking stability is low? Maybe that's what it is. Let's just do it. 120. And yeah, we have 509. Whatever. Yeah, see, look. That's, now it's done. And where are these Sunni zealots? Messina, Kitsina, Zamfara, Gobir. Oh, my God. I don't want to waste all the man, the military power. Yeah, I, just, I guess we'll just deal with it when we come to it. Gain trader. Our free trade policies and merchants become innovative. Nice. I don't know what that means. Is that a new... No. Is it uh, one of these things? Wait, where is that? Is, isn't it government, isn't it? Trading in slaves? Hmm, no, I don't know. Siege of Malil is over, which is good. And now we can begin ferrying troops over as well. Well, actually, we could just come over here to Tangiers. And we can begin our carpet sieging. Our blanket sieges. I'm just gonna do this. Um, it's a little bit more... We're gonna lose more men this way. But I think it's okay. Because we have the manpower to float it. And once this guy is done... When are you guys going to arrive? Okay, and then, uh, and then, yeah, we're going to get more men over in Iberia. It's going to be great. And we should be able to take them out. Again, we're losing so many men by doing this. Like, we, there's a so much safer way. Uh, you know what? We'll do it with the further troops. We'll do it the safer way. Honestly. Okay. We shall continue the sieges. Ah, Siege of Fez is done. Excellent. Get these forces into Tangier. Why don't we? 12th of April. We're pretty close to the 12th of April, so that's that's good, at least. Uh, you guys, why don't you stay in our land so that, uh, you know, we could, we could do things. Also, what are we doing on Force Limit? Our Force Limit's still high enough, but we could, if I could just select the army. No, okay, whatever. 12th of April, okay, they're done. Okay, attach to transport. Get to Algrave. It's safer. Oh my god! You're gonna lose to rebels? What are you doing? Shybons? Can you can you help me, please? You're gonna be fighting rebels and shit? Really? Hey, native assimilation on Grain Coast. Grain Coast, uh How are you looking? You're looking pretty good, man. 
And we got money going. Dude, I'm feeling I'm feeling fancy. I'm feeling free. We should leave that there. Uh, and then I, I couldn't see this shit. Alright, go ahead. Attach the transport. I guess you could just stay here. Okay. So there's 12 over there. So once we siege out the southern lands... Once we siege out the south... Oh god, I'm not... I'm... I'm... Pause. Uh, once we siege out the south, then we can... We can get up north, take out these armies, and then get, uh... Get a little bit more going. We can get over here, probably. And hope that these fucking dudes don't, uh... Don't mess me up. Hmm. Okay. Feeling pretty good so far. Um these sieges are, are going. Uh oh! He's coming. He's a coming. Alright. Fine. I hope are they gonna beat me? 17th of July, 13th of July. No, he's not gonna beat me. You suck, noob. Alright. So this guy wants to fight. I'll fight you. I'll fight you, buddy. I'll fight you dead. We just have to wait for the Siege of Granada to be done. Oh, God, I forgot. There's another thing over there. Oh, and we're paused. God damn it! I'm a big dummy. It's okay. Let's, uh, select army. Detach siege. Keep this siege going. Once we get this siege is com completed... Ah, slaves will now be produced on the Green Coast. Excellent. That's a lot of money. Uh, Shaibans, can you go blow up their army, please? Siege of Grenada is over. Amazing. I would like them to massacre their army, if at all possible. Uh, good. That's just desert. We can fight on this land, honestly. It's a little bit prettier, you know? That's how I feel. Oh, um... With Morocco. Alright, we're called Diplomat. We're at 200, so, um... Annex Vassal, 1523. See, that's a problem. We can't... We're not the same religious group, so we can't do the royal marriage, which I was afraid of. Uh, and I don't know how to switch over religions, honestly, because I can't convert. So that's a bit of a bu bu bummer. It's okay. Once these all these sieges are completed, or at least these two sieges at Cordoba and Andalusia, we'll be able to do things. Now, let's see. What what I want is this. How much is this going to cost? Oh my god. 104 overextension. Eesh. But it only costs 38. And some money. All that money. 47. We can make them release Navara. And the Umayyads. <laughs> That'd be kind of funny. Oh, releasing that land would be hilarious. Um, returning cores. Well, okay, so what if we took this out? Wow. So... Melilla, the least important land. I, I honestly don't need Kuwaita, Kiyuta. So, hmm. Hmm. The overextension is really a total bummer. But, um, I don't know. We'll work it out, I guess. We'll twerk it out. Shaiban, seriously, though, like, you know... I called you into war, I assumed that maybe you would do something. You do have 28 men just sitting here, there are 12. You know how much prestige you could get from just destroying them, murdering, massacring these men? What's your tech? Oh, you're at tech 7. Oh, that makes more sense, actually. Okay. Alright, well, fair enough then. 
I understand, Shybons. <laughs> I get it. You're at Tech 7. Shit, we could probably crush the Shybons then. This is actually the perfect time to crush them and get what we can, but unfortunately we can't break off too much land. As you see here, the overextension is just a killer. Just the super duper killer, man. Uh, but that's okay. It's alright. How are you guys doing over here? Yeah, they're fine. Doing a little bit of, uh, blockading. That's good, at least. Oh, good, that siege is done. Excellent. Trade dispute casts his belly against somebody. Okay, that siege is finished. So here we go, the big battle, the battle to rule them all. We have a 1-3-2, and we have four... Oh no, we have one in artillery, so we get a little bit more fire. They have two artillery, so they get more fire. And they have two in fire, but zero in shock. But we do also get a shock advantage. I think we should be okay, and we're only fighting into desert. So I think we should be okay here. Yeah, they're actually going to leave. Which is good news for us. Okay, here we go. Here we go. We're kicking their asses, actually. Okay, fire phase, they definitely kick our asses in the fire phase, which is bad. But we won. We won. We took them out. Excellent. And now they are going to, um... Castilla la Vieja. Vieja. Excellent. We have reinforcements here down in the south as well, so... I don't really have to worry so much about that. Hmm. Might not be the best fight. Okay, yeah, it was the best fight. Never mind, just kidding. Where are these guys going? Aragon. Wait, what is Aragon? Okay, it's just desert. So we could probably handle this. I would love for people to attach to unit. Um, yeah, I mean, they have lower morale. We could, we could probably stomp them. Probably? Yeah, okay, good. Okay, so we begin sieging out their land, which is good. We only need 47% war score. And then we could get the lands that we want and the money that we want. Are we faster? Yeah, we are. Alright, cool. So we could detach siege. Or actually, detach another siege. Alright, and begin the sieges. The sieges now begin. And we shall strike them down with great vengeance and furious anger. Those who attempt to poison and destroy my brothers. And he will know my name is the Lord. Siege of Gibraltar is over, excellent. So you can start the siege here in Caceres. Well, okay, they do have an army here, but we have Abu... Uh, Abi Bakr Musa going. So Abi Bakr Musa, kick their asses. Yeah, you should be able to do it. Yeah, excellent work. We don't have a leader here, but we do have better shock. Let's let's keep it going here this way. Hey, more manpower. More manpower to you. Okay, we did win that battle, which is good. Three troops here versus their two. But do they have a leader? They don't have a leader. Oh, no, they do have a leader. Okay, that's fine. We should still be able to win. Indeed, we did. We were inevitably victorious. Victorious! Uh, oh, no. That sucks. Okay, we unfortunately don't have enough men to siege out their whole thing. Soiree! Okay. The chandeliers blaze shadows and light across the grand ballroom of your palace and the music of a hundred dancing violins fill the air. Your Majesty, Your Excellency, my Queen. The foreign guests and local dignitaries greet you. Everywhere is conversation, laughter, discussion, and the breathing, pulsating rhythm of life. Your eyes gaze across the assembled myriads. Who should you talk to tonight? Okay, so a new legal heir. 322. I think we gain the new legal heir because we don't have one. Oh, do we have one? 
No, wait, that's that's not me. Amalian Noble. Okay, so we would get a new heir, which I think is okay. He only has a weak claim. Also, why are we losing money? What is this from? Army maintenance. Ugh. All right, that's fine. Let's get the new legal heir. Diara, a new queen. We're only going to be a nation of queens, and you know what? I'm okay with that. I am a-okay with that. Okay, we're just gonna go back and forth destroying their armies as they're built. That's okay. Once one of these sieges is done, we don't have to do this anymore, but we'll just keep doing that. The army maintenance taking up some monies, but that's okay. Not the biggest deal in the world. The house of Sani is shaken. There seems to be a misunderstanding regarding the heritage of the great-grandmother of Dejeni II. It seems that she was the daughter of a lowly farmer outside Gao. So we lose legitimacy or prestige. Acknowledge the fact. Yeah, we're gonna lose the prestige because we got fucking bank. We've got bank levels of prestige and a new technology. Oh. And we're not ahead on tech either. An improved maneuver plus 25%. I mean, can you go wrong? And we get a writer. Oh, we get all this new stuff. Fuck yeah. Yes. Oh my god, we have all these brand new... We have Pike Infantry, which is amazing. Eastern Hussar, amazing. And a Culverin, which actually... Uh, it has better shock. I guess that's okay. Yeah, alright, fine. We'll get the Culverin going. Whatever. Our, uh, our, our, uh, things, our, our, uh, morale is super duper low right now, which is unfortunate. So, uh, we're gonna have to wait to fight these guys, because when you switch over, then, uh, then that becomes a bit of a problem. But, like, one of these sieges is bound to be done soon. Peace offer from the Idrisids. Okay, they seed Fez. They'll pay 150 bucks. No. Uh, here's a question. Can I get what I want? No. Can I... Oh, I can do it without money, though. And you know, that might be a good idea. Without all the money, I can do it. That's as much money as I can get. Do we get anything else? We get an old treaties. Man. Do they have a treaty with... Man, they got some serious... Alliances. Oh, it's military access. Oh, it's just military access. Okay, I don't really care about that. Um... Alright. Fuck it. Let's do it. Here we go, victory! The war is victorious! And you know what? We'll see the consequences of that victorious war after this episode is done. So anyway, hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. This has been uh, EU4. Doing more EU4. It was a good time. I enjoyed myself. So hopefully you guys enjoyed it as well. We've had a victory here, and we have brand new troops that are amazing. Now we just have to spend a lot of administrative power to core all of these nations, and uh, hopefully not incur too many rebellions, uh, but we should be able to defeat them pretty easily. Anyway, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. This has been EU4, and we will do more in the future. I've enjoyed myself. Hopefully you're enjoying yourself. I'll see you next time. This is Alpaca Patrol signing out. Peace, fools.